Regardless if it's a bottle or can, I'm going to be reviewing a beer today, guys. Oh, Beast's Beer Reviews. Beast's Beer Reviews. Beast's Beer Reviews. What's up, guys? It's another episode of Beast's Beer Reviews. It's what we see. Well, got kind of a... I don't know. It's a strange one. Or complicated, I should say. Yeah, not this one. Well, I've got today, and before I get started, it's 88 degrees outside, well, dew point humidity, it feels like it's 93, so it's hot, real hot, damn hot out here, and I'm doing Blackdown Scotch Ale by the Arcadia Brewing Company, so this is what I'm doing here, yep, this is what I'm doing. And this is, like I said, a complicated one. Now, I found that there was a smokehouse by the same, kind of the same name, Arcadia Cooking, or something to, to that effect. Now, well, Arcadia Brewing Company had a facilities in Kalamazoo and Battle Creek. And it was an operation from 1996 to 2019 and closed in 2019 the money problems okay. and then uh, in 2020 the super fluid supply company a division of Elk Rapids based of based on shorts brewing company yeah and they purchased Arcadia's beer and property, or basically all the rights to Arcadia beer, and plans to release other Arcadia beers in the coming years. So, this is one of many that I guess Schwartz is going to be doing because on the labeling here on the front, you've got really no indication of Schwartz Brewing Company. And the only thing you do have indicating that is the bottle cap as somebody wearing a pair of shorts. So it's shorts brewing company. So they're running Arcadia beer through their facilities or brewing Arcadia beer through their facilities. So this one, as far as I can tell, is an 8.0 APV with a 16 IV. And this was packaged on 419 of this year. So it's really fresh, or at least fresh enough. So we're still good with all this. Crack those beer can, the bottle top, pop those bottle top. Get some nice smoke. Ooh, wow. Okay. Well, let's see what we got here. Looks like it's got a caramel color point out of it. Bottle. This one's kind of a unique one, to say the least. It's got kind of a, almost, maybe a half a finger head's worth of head on here. You know, it's kind of cloudy. That reminds me of tea. Got some nice, I guess, golden, dark caramel color to it. Getting some carbonations on here. It's about a medium carbonation on here. Bubble formation on the top. Those small, medium, some large. Get some caramel on there. Get the slight hit hit the alcohol. I want to say coffee. It's supposed to be a coffee off of this, but. It's 
smells like I'm getting some biscuity smell off of this as well. It's like plum. Yeah. And, well, it smells like jibber jibber. We'll see how it's available to taste. Wow, that's nice. Good mouthfeel. Definitely tells us some caramel off of this. Definitely get some biscuity quality to it. <clears throat> it's really not going lingering on the tongue. It's getting a good mouthfeel on this. Nothing's lingering. Getting a, a good taste of alcohol a little bit, but it's just enough to notice. So it's not overpowering. It seems like it's being really balanced with this beer. So, yeah, I was a bit confused when I picked up this beer. And see a kitty of brewing company on there, and then see the shorts bottle cap on top. So, It's really good. Look at this one. Yep. And, you know, it's got a nice color to it. Lacings, nah. It, it's not much here. It's not much here. Left the lacing. <coughs> you know, I just wish I would have tried some of this beer while Arcadia Brewing Company was in operation. So I could have some frame of reference to uh, compare the two and see if it was exactly the same. But I can't, so I won't. Kind of like the labeling on this. You got like a old castle with black nests on there. So. <laughs> Well, if I had to give this one a grade, I would have to say, hold on. A nine. Yep. I mean, it's a good beer. It's a good beer. Really good beer. Enjoyed it. So, yeah. <clears throat> you guys stay safe out in this heat, man. I swear. Stay safe in this heat. You know, it's, it's, getting, it's getting too hot for me out here, man. So, well, it's like I've always said. Hey. Responsible, don't do nothing stupid. Peace out, man. Peace out, sister. I'll see you next time. BC's here. BC's going to drink some beers to take a seat. They would have no fear. He will certainly bring the cheer. Sit down and don't move that beer. BC.